Hey everyone, welcome to Mobility Academy. I'm the flexibility guy, Coach Alia, and in this video, I want to show you a strategy which you can use to improve your lunge position and to stretch not only your hip flexors and your hamstrings, which are usually the muscles that are involved in a lunge position, but with this strategy, you're going to stretch also the muscles on the outside of your leg, so your abductors, and the muscles on the inside of your leg, so your adductors, okay? But before I start, let me ask you to subscribe to the channel if you are new and turn on the notifications so you'll never miss one of my next videos, okay? With that said, Let's start. So I first saw this strategy from one of my first teachers, Kit. I, I, I will leave his Instagram and his website down below. So um, I really find it interesting cause with this strategy from a lunch position, you can explore different stretches without like exiting from the lunge, which is really beneficial, especially if you warm up your hips or you wanna like find other ways to stretch your adductors or abductors, okay? So to start, all you wanna do is start in a lunge, of course. You can place like a pillow under your, mm, your knee to stay more comfortable in the stretch. And I also use a, a yoga block under my back foot because in this way I feel more comfortable now from this position you just make the lunge okay let me place my setup correctly okay now from this position here as you can see I am in a lunge okay from this position all I want to do with my back leg maybe it's better if I show you the exercise with the other leg okay all I want to do here now this is the standard lunge okay what I want to do here is to turn my back leg into a different position to stretch my abductors or my adductors so this is the front position so I'm facing in front of me with my back leg okay and this is the standard lunge position now what if I turn my leg this way so I externally rotate my leg I can show you it another time now as you can see here I am in a hip abduction movement so I'm stretching my adductors here and I need to turn my body to the side here now this position is really strong as a stretch for my adductors here and the purpose is always like pushing the hips down but in this way you're not going to stretch your hip flexors like here but you're going to stretch your adductors and you are in a completely different stretch, but just with one movement here. Okay, so you push your hips down, you keep your front shin bone perpendicular to the floor, and you just push the hips down. Now here, my knee is flexed with a 90 degree angle, and I'm using the, the yoga block to support myself in the position. Okay, so this is the first variation. As you can see, really simple. Okay, from a lunge position, you just turn your back leg out. So you externally rotate the leg, you just make the lunge a little bit like, you like move your front foot forward and you go down with your hips. This is the first strategy. Now, the second strategy and I'm going to show you the second strategy with the other leg. So, rather than doing that, you can also see the, the first strategy from another, from, another, from another angle now, okay? This is the first strategy. So I'm going to push my hips down and this will stretch my adductors here. As you can see, 90 degree angle here on my knee. Rather than doing that, I want to do something like 
that. As you can see, now I'm turning my leg in. So I'm internally rotating my leg and I am trying to turn also my body to the side here. And now I don't need the, the yoga block because what I want to do from here is to straighten the leg here. Now you need of course some yoga blocks because in this way you can support yourself in the position and you can also put your your like the opposite hand of the back leg on your front knee in this way you can really support your upper body and then you lift the leg and you will feel a nice sensation of stretch in the outer part of your back leg and also here or but like on your obliques here in this area here of your body so when you do that you don't want to use the the yoga block because you you need to be stable in the position okay you turn your body to the side towards your front leg and you lift your back knee here and you try to internally internally rotate your back leg as much as possible and you hold this position here okay and then you can return and i really lo love to play with the variation number one where i go here and then maybe i span six to ten breaths here and then i go with the second variation but before i maybe i i stop here just for a second in the regular lunge and then i go with the second one i turn and i lift another six to ten breaths and that's it i really love to warm up my hips my legs with this exercise here which is called the hip compass because it's like uh, a compass where you move your your back leg into a different position and you stretch a different muscle so six to ten breaths in the passive positions so you, maybe you start in a regular lunge then you do the variation number one where you externally rotate your leg and you stretch your adductors six to ten breaths there then you come back into the lunge you remain there again six to ten breaths and then you you do the second variation you internally rotate the leg and you stretch your abductors and your obliques there and then you can return into the lunge and this is huge there's a huge variation, there's a huge kind of sequence that will allow you to warm up your legs and your hips before, maybe before a flexibility workout or maybe before a strength session or before like a running session or just as a cool down, it's excellent. Whatever you wanna do, you will definitely improve your flexibility by doing this exercise here. So the hip compass with all its variations okay so with that said i really hope that you have enjoyed this exercise here and if you give it a go please let me know in the comments also if you have any further questions if you enjoyed the content as well please hit that like button and with that said that's all from the flexibility guy coach elia have a nice stretch and see you in the next video